Alright, I don't care. I know a lot of people have asked a question like, how do I add another type of leg or how do I, or something like that. I'll show you, I'll show you. It's really easy. So just, if you want to add like this stupid cord blocks like thingy that all these slenders have, <laughs> I don't know. If you, if you need, if you need this, then I'll show you how to do it. Okay, okay, wait. I, I need an avatar for it. Avatar. An avatar. So that works. So I'll just export this to Blender. So you want to install the add-on by going to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons, and then clicking Install, and then selecting the zip file. Um, and then you just want to check that this is enabled right here. Be sure that you're using, I'm not I'm not using the latest version uh, because the 2.0 release is coming in a few months. Um, and I, I think this version of this version is fine, but just download the latest version. Um, I could install it right now, actually. All right, there you go. I installed it. So I just installed the zip file. I didn't unzip it. I just downloaded the zip file. Okay, there you go. Now you just want to import the correct wavefront OBJ. A mistake I see a lot of people do is not going here and selecting split by group. You should do that. So just click on split by group. And then go here and then import the OBJ. There you go, now you got the core blocks leg thingy. Um, I don't need anything else, so I'll just press Control i and then I'll just delete everything. There you go. So scrolling, right? Okay. If you want to do this thingy that I always do, just press F3, then F3 on your keyboard, um, and then go walk navigation, and then you see this right here, and it will say like, a random hotkey just select that and change the shortcut and then just um, I do shift and F that works fine for me so as you can see shift F and uh, yeah that works fine for me so I'll do that so now I have the core blocks leg now let's add the starter rigs where did I put it where is it oh there it is I have a ton of add-ons I need to clean that up but okay let's say we want I don't know superhero rig okay so we don't need this leg anymore, so just delete it. It doesn't matter anymore. Oh no wait, we need it. Sorry, we need it. Alright. So if, if your leg does not cover the core blocks leg, be sure to make it do so. Oh wait, no, what am I talking about? No, delete it. Never mind. Ignore what I was gonna talk about. Core block is really simple. Just go here and go to pose mode. So okay, I'll I'll have to really explain this like a beginner. Click on this with your left click mouse button thing, and then holding shift on your keyboard, um, holding shift on your keyboard, click on the left mouse button, click uh, on um, the rig. There you go, and then go to pose mode right here. Just slide your mouse over here, then press this with your left mouse button, click, and go to pose mode. There you go, and then just select this bone, move it. So you're moving that bone, this should be highlighted. Press control, left control. I think the right control works as well. Yeah, it does. Just control and then P and then um, bone. And now if I go back to object mode and I go back to post mode again. Uh, yeah, as you can see, it works so fine. There you go. So now you have this. If you need a headless head, just go here and then just delete it. It's that simple. So now you have a headless head. Uh, let's check, and there you go. It works fine. So now you have that. If you don't want these bones anymore, you can just go to pose mode again, and then go here, and then uh, just make these zero. Same with this one. Now you can also do it with this one as well. There you go. So now you have just this bone, so it doesn't distract you or anything. And you can also turn IK on, but I don't know, it's useless for this leg at least.